Hi, I'm Tony Spy on Hillside Christmas Tree Farm, and today we are in the middle of April, and we are going to do some burning. Um, basically, we have been planting this one spruce field that we've been, uh, I, if you've been following along, the, the sale spruce field that we've been having. And basically, we started planting this thing, I think I was in high school, so the trees were 20 years old, and we finally, this past year, got rid of the, the remainder of them. So this year, we want to basically um, burn the piles that you can see, and basically get that whole four acres uh, plowed up, you know, and prepped so that we can begin planting next spring. We're gonna spend kind of this year plowing and working and flattening the ground. Um, we're gonna have to do some drainage a little bit because the way the driveway comes down, the creek is in the middle and everything kind of drains toward that creek. We're gonna do some drainage work this year, hopefully, and divert some of the water, not through the middle of the field, and get a cover crop I'm hoping in, get some soil tests, but we're going to replant that four acres and be dedicated to our spruce. And every year we're going to plant uh, about 400 trees, and that would be 50 trees a row going from the driveway to the north, and just kind of work down that field in our rotation. So that's the plan. Uh, we tried burning, there's a bunch of gnats flying around to drive me nuts. Um, I tried burning, uh, maybe in February before my dad got back to Florida and it did not work out very well. We've had some 80 degree days in April, so hopefully a lot better. Got some guys over here to help and uh, hopefully we'll have some big fires today. So stay tuned.
That is a big fire. All right, and six hours later, we are done burning our spruce field. Uh, great timing because I just heard thunder kind of rolling in. As you can see behind me, it's kind of just kind of smoldering down. Um, I'm very excited about this because now we kind of have a, a blank slate basically to set how the rotation of our spruce field is going to go moving forward. Uh, next step, I think we're going to try to hire one of our neighbors that has a little bit bigger equipment than us to kind of plow the field and hopefully they can turn up the stumps also at the same time. And yeah, it should be good. Um, I want to I spend the next year. So we're going to start planting next, next spring in uh, 24. So it will be basically 400 trees, eight rows, and we fit 50 a row. Um, so eight rows, and we're going to march just down toward Sharon Hollow. And by the time we're at the end, we're hopefully we're harvesting and clearing at the front, and that's just going to be it. We're just going to rotate in that area with the spruce, and the rest of the land will be get dedicated to, to uh, fir. So burning. It was very hot. Um, we had one kind of scary call where the wind kind of picked up a bit and caught some grass and almost ran into the tall grass, but we, uh, we got ahead of it. Then I hooked up my small sprayer because we had a big sprayer accident. I'm sure dad was chuckling while he's going to watch this one and I'm talking about it. So we hooked up my little baby sprayer and handled some of that uh, extra little, little wild running grass stuff. Worked out great. So all right, happy planting. That'll be the next series that we'll be doing. We're talking about planting and getting that ready. So thanks for watching.